Libre Elec, or Jellyfin. If you're building a home media setup, these two free open source options take very different paths. Let's break down what each one does best and who they're really for. Libre Elec is a minimal Linux-based OS designed to run Kodi and nothing else. It's the ultimate plug-and-play solution for turning a Raspberry Pi, Intel NUC, or similar device into a dedicated media center. Boot it up and you're straight into Kodi, no desktop, no distractions. It's lightweight, fast, and optimized for smooth 4K playback, even on low-powered hardware. The latest version, Libre Elec 12.0.2, comes bundled with Kodi 21.2, giving you access to a massive library of add-ons for streaming, local playback, and more. If you want a living room friendly setup that just works with a remote, Libre Elec nails it. Now, Jellyfin is a full blown media server. You install it on your PC, an ass, or even a Docker container, and it organizes your entire media library movies, shows, music, books, photos, and streams it to any device you own. It's like having your own private Netflix, but with no subscriptions, no tracking, and total control. Jellyfin supports live TV, DVR, multiple user profiles, parental controls, and even sync play for remote watch parties. The latest version adds HDR10 and Dolby Vision support, plus smoother transcoding and trick play previews. It's incredibly flexible, but you'll need to set up the server yourself and manage your own storage. So here's the call. If you want a simple remote-controlled media box for your TV, LibreLC is the way to go. But if you're after a powerful, customizable media server that streams to all your devices, Jellyfin is the better fit. Both are free, open source, and awesome, but they serve very different needs.